Hi guys, I'm Exact Chaos and welcome back to another episode of Foundation. This village is coming along super nicely. Got two more villages coming in here over here. And what we need to do over now, over now, what we need to do today is build a church. And I'm kind of tempted to come and build, ooh, there's a little bit of a hill going on over here. So I'm kind of tempted to build the church right over here. So let's have a look see what we can do with the church we've got all the other stuff in place so we should be making our own tools now right just hang on let's just have a look bread is coming along are we making our own tools we are indeed making our own tools so that's pretty cool so that's what we're doing so now let's grab the church and stone red blue the core and the red one and the blue one. Now we're just going to go with stone, I believe. Why on earth is it doing that? Is it this is like weird? Is it weird? Okay, so let's do that. Something like that. Oh yeah, that's pretty cool. I like that idea. The big tower, uh, we'll have the big tower at the back here, right? That's awesome. The small tower. Yeah, that's pretty cool. And the door, kind of right over there, right? Something like that. That's pretty awesome as well. Then extension A. Actually, let's grab the door. Let's place the door on extension A and we'll move. Where are we going to put extension A? Right in the middle? We actually can't put extension A right in the middle. Uh, I want to actually put it over here. So let's turn it and we put it in there. Uh, but let's, ooh, that's not quite what I want. Put that one there and put that one there. Excellent. I, I like that idea. Then what we'll do is we'll turn this one a little bit and we will plop it in there. I like that idea. Let's grow that one till about that. That's not bad. I like that. Okay, now extension B. I'm kind of thinking that extension B. We could do. No, come on, guys can't actually see is that no that doesn't work over there so extension B like so oops no over here no over there and something like that we'll do another extension B on this side Okay, oh, and even more villages. Now, all I'm going to need to do is make sure that we get this thing at approximately the same height. Yeah, that's pretty cool. Now, a round tower. Uh, I don't think we need a round tower. I think that's okay. Let's uh, go without it. Let's get the cross in place. Why is the cross doing funny stuff for us oh. at the top guys at the top oh now that's that's not good where's the cross mm. where did the cross go a villager is upgrading a house that's good uh, I can't find the cross Somehow, I've lost the cross. Whether we have one or not, I don't know. 
But how do I get it all the way at the top? So we need to... How do I get it up there? Oh, oh. Is it up there? I can't actually see it. What's down here? Can we see something down here? Yeah, I don't know. I think it's. A, I've got a little bit of a... It's a little bit weird. I can't actually get it to work that well. A gargoyle? Kind of had one. Ah, there it is. So, ah, there's the cross. Excellent. I just want to... Don't want it there. This is very weird. Yes, that's what I wanted. There we go. That's perfect. A gargoyle over there, a cross over there. That's pretty good. Then, ooh, stained glass is not going to work. Decorative tree. Arch. What is the arch going to look like? Nah, let's uh, get rid of that. Get rid of the arch and then a wall fountain. I'm also not sure we're going to need a wall fountain. That is good. Now, that's going to be the church right there. So let's get underway and start the construction. It's going to cost us like 20 gold. No upfront cost, no monument value. It's got a 31 villager capacity. Um, Yeah, it's okay. Let's, uh, how many, I don't even know how many, we've got like 52 villages. So potentially what we need to do is, is do some more extensions, actually. Let's do that. Let's get extension A again. We do something like that. Looks a little weird though. But now it's got a 36 villager capacity. So let's do the same thing on this side. Let's pop it in there. Let's get another extension A. We'll plop it in there. What we're going to do is we're going to need to... Is that actually... No, that's a little bit... Yes, that's what I wanted. And just want to make sure that we... Actually get it to kind of the same height there starting to look a little funny now uh, actually what I wanted to do is make sure that we drop that to around there Something like that's kind of okay, and now it's got like a 41 villager capacity. We'll we'll build that. It's going to be a pretty substantial church. Let's start the construction, guys. How many villages and builders do we have to come and do this? Uh, let's have a look. We've got like tons of these guys not doing anything. So builder, 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 uh, and should we stop immigration for a little bit? Let's uh, let's just stop immigration a little bit. We've got tons of extra people and we need to make sure that we get our get our stuff doing its thing. Uh, villagers upgrading a house. What's happening over here? Do we have uh, wool? Uh, we were building... Ah, over here. This thing isn't actually accepting anything. So you're going to go that and some of this and some of that. Not that, not that, not that. Not that. Uh, you can do flour. You can do iron ore, you can do some berries, you can do some glass, definitely do bread, none of this. Uh, you can do stone and you can do uh, you can do planks as well. There we go. And let's assign two villages to it straight away. Perfect. So there we go. That's going to start uh, working. 
So immediately things are happening at the church. Construction is underway. Um, okay, so now what I want to have a quick look at these things. Let's uh, stop accepting certain things over here. So let's stop accepting that. Stock maximum, empty stock. Thank you. Lots of wood over here. But how are we doing on planks? Our planks is getting a little bit lower. Yes, we're actually clearing this area quite nicely. Um, anything else? I don't want to accept bread over here. We've got glass. How on earth did we get glass? Is glass created from somewhere? It's not a byproduct, is it? So where on earth did we get the glass from? I have no idea. But what I'm keen on doing is actually getting another um, a farm up and running somewhere. So shall we have a look? Is that construction underway? I'm guessing we're waiting for all kinds of stuff to come in over here. Lots and lots of tools is required. Gold is in here. Oh, we're over the top of gold over there. Excellent. I'm liking this little village. Um, I want to get a, get a good view of how much of some of these things we have. We've got some wool. The weaver is just struggling, struggling to keep pace. So we probably need another weaver's hut somewhere. So let's get the construction underway. Let's grab a weaver's hut. Weaver, weaver. Where is the weaver? Clothes market, a weaver's hut. Okay, so we'll add another weaver's hut over here. Interesting little village setup we've got. I'm, gl I'm glad we still have a few trees in there. That works quite well for us. So we're waiting for two things over here locked. We need 10 citizens, but we need to get the faith up and running before we can do that. Oh, the other thing I want to keen on doing is let's edit. I want to add yet another treasury to the mix over here. No idea what that does if, if the height does anything. If we move it over there. We can start the construction. It's just going to cost a few extra pieces. Let's start the construction so we at least have our treasury. Increase our treasury a little bit. The Lord's Manor. Lots of stuff happening. The church is coming along nicely over here. I do like it. It's it's. I like the graphics. I like what's going on. Uh, but of course, it's still in very very early alpha. So uh, I'm not sure we've got even half the f the, the stuff that we actually need on here. Okay, so the next thing I want to start looking at building is get out of there and let's get another wheat farm up and running we'll do that I can keep clearing this area that's not bad how is our wheat supply looking not not good not good at all that's it come on get out of there what is this one is that all it can't be all warehouses it's the other warehouse so we're out of wheat right yeah we're out of wheat how's our tools looking accepting but yeah we're out of tools because we're using them all at the moment probably need another okay so let's um Let's quickly have a look at our villages. So we've got two transporters. We've got like one that's unemployed over here. It's going to come and farm. So we're probably going to need a few more people. So let's allow a little bit more immigration. I keep clicking this thing out. So let's make sure that we've assigned yet another builder. Good. Good, good, good. 
got so much gold we can actually look at expanding yet again but I don't think I necessarily want to do that if I expand I might grab this tile over here so that we can start by actually looking at building a wall actually that would be pretty cool so let's actually do pick up this one uh, oop, that's not what I wanted I wanted this one let's add that one now it's gonna be more expensive still not more expensive so still pretty pretty cheap to sort it out I'm kind of keen on building a wall two new villages have arrived part of my territory thank you very much what's happening with our budget obviously a lot of costly we on the consumption we're making a lot of money a lot of money from clothes not so much though but yes, we'll get the extra weaver's hut up and running over here. And that should help us out a little bit. Okay, again, we've got some two more people. Uh, oh, they're going to join. They've not joined just yet. Let's leave that in place for now. Isabel has got everything she, she, she needs. She just needs faith to be further fulfilled. <laughs> Look at the cross hanging out and the gargoyle pieces are being built little by little do we need to assign like a like a villager to work here or something no idea so yes what I'm keen on doing is actually seeing about the walls so have a look at the walls so small stone walls small stone wall light wooden wall large stone wall that doesn't look like a large stone wall to me and a small stone wall now they all look exactly the same from that perspective so if we okay so if we build i think there's a gate here somewhere right a wooden gate used as an entrance that's a wooden gate we don't have a stone gate do we maybe one of these is the stone gate we'll see not going to necessarily build it now obviously the game still doesn't include any big issues with um, kind of combat or anything like that but if I look at the trade menu right if we go to the trade menu you can immediately see there's some allegiances going on which means that we're of course going to um, going to run into that kind of stuff later on given the fact that we've got stone walls and stuff in here that's also another uh, sure sign that we're going to run into these kind of problems okay all these other things are starting to be built got two new people here let's throw them into the builders mix for now just need to make sure we get all of our builders sorted back into some other uses as soon as the church is built because we're not going to need that many builders just like a handful one or two two maybe to hang around and build things as required i'm glad we still have a few trees in the, in here it actually looks pretty good to have them there okay so what else what else yeah so we're going getting another wheat farm over here and we might add an extra bakery and all these kind of things but yes, wheat is certainly starting to roll in, maybe. It takes a little... I don't know. We're not getting a lot of lot happening. How's our flower looking? No flower. What's happening over here? We've got some flower. Got some bread over here. But yeah, it's pretty slow going. Pretty slow going. We have bread over here. No bread. Everything's emptied out. okay so i think yeah let's just get this this built what else do we need over here um all the tools that we require is in here we need a ton more stone though a ton more stone where else can we get some stone what's going on with that Oof, i should stop spending definitely stop spending Two new villagers is joining the village. Um, I think um, after that I should stop the immigration. Certainly. And I'm kind of tempted to stop the trading of um, <clears throat> of this. So let's, um, let's just trade 10 at a time. Not, not any more than that. Hopefully that should be sufficient. Are these things one by one or... 
That's just the total. Oh, we can actually prioritize the building. That's pretty good. Yeah, so these don't actually get depleted. How many do we have that's doing iron? Only like two. And I think our iron ore is just way up there. Our money is starting to come back in. We can actually forage some more some old food over here but the one thing we're probably short on is um is stone an extra piece of stone would be good villagers upgrading their house so they're just adding these little awnings and things on here that's the bakery up oh, good stuff so now this is done um i don't think we have oh we have extra villagers so do we have even more no that's the the only two and then what I'm keen on doing is actually painting another farming area so a uh, farm field area like over here okay uh, yes get out of there so we're going to do some fields so hopefully we get some more wheat going this one is also kind of getting there okay so let's stop the immigration for now let's just uh, stop stop it stop it there how much more do we need over here so still a ton of stone that we require yeah a ton of stone we're only like halfway through the stone requirement here Planks is done, tools is done, so tools should be right up there again. We shouldn't be have any further issues with tools. So that's just the, the line. Excellent, things are looking pretty good. Uh, let's quickly have a look. If we paint a little bit more, are we at the end of our residential piece? add a little few spots there okay so they can add a few more houses in this area and they're immediately starting to build right here next to the church uh, people are starting to build houses straight away good opportunity for them to get straight into it what are we waiting for here again with the stone yes of course all that we're building we're definitely uh, looking for more stone tons of boulders hanging around yeah stone is just the shortage here so let's turn one of these rudolph into a farmer as well can we move you over to farmer thank you building a house has been completed over here good stuff and another Tools are rolling in. We still have a decent amount of money. But yes, keen to get things working a little better. We need more of the bread. Definitely. Running out of food. Slow, man. Very slow. Just three more houses done. Oh, well, that's just still stuff that was there, up there. Yeah, looking good looking good looking good okay uh can we how long is it going to take to finish this thing can we buy some stone well not that we have tons of uh tons of stuff so can we buy stone selling selling now so no one can buy can can sell us any stone we're gonna need and more of this so maybe i'll just plop one in there so let's grab it just the way you see to get things done. So another stone cutters camp. I think that's a pretty decent spot right there. So build another one of those for us. So we can add some more stone cutters and hopefully make use of the same piece. And then we'll hopefully get a little bit more stone out of the mix. 
There's some other areas. We can build a bridge at some point once we have eight citizens. So at the moment, we certainly have none. We've got 38 commoners and 20 serfs. So we're definitely not meeting everybody's demands. We need tons more food and tons more clothes. We're so slowly getting there. But stone is holding us back for now. We need stone for this. We don't. So can we... Uh, they should be able to build this pretty quickly. And we'll be able to throw some of our builders towards that as well. Towards actually cutting some stone from here. Nice going. So this we can work. Tons of people can work on this one. Oh, actually, I think more people can actually work on any one of them. That's getting there. Let's speed it up a little. Yeah, I forgot we can speed do that as well. That's slowly getting there. We get that in place. We might get a little bit more stone out of the mix. So now some of these builders. Anna, you're going to be a stone cutter. And Dominique, you're going to be a stone cutter. And um, Lauren, you're going to be a stone cutter. So next to three stone cutters is hopefully going to going to help things out a little bit, get a little bit more stone to the mix. I'm hoping that'll help us. Ah, here we go. Our new fields are doing their thing. Let's have a quick look. Is it growing on the, on this area? Well, they should be growing it there. No reason it shouldn't. It's nice and fertile anyway. Nice, they're slowly clearing out this area, which is good. That one is con constantly being re uh, reforested. Good, good, so we're not running out of stuff. Are we getting our stone supply up there a little better? I think we are. Our happiness is dropping a little bit, so the global happiness is a little down. Factor has lacked. Yeah, so they still need a little bit better messaging over here. Let us see. We are producing stone. Hopefully at a fairly decent rate. What's going on over here? Wow, they still need a fair bit more stone. But that's that that number is actually dropping. And these numbers keep changing. I don't quite understand why it is. Is they completely different pieces for the different piece uh, for the different uh, components? I've no idea. But I think we're getting pretty close to finishing this one off, though. That one needs like two more, then they can use that as well. How are we doing on wool? The weaver's hut is done. Um, let's just have a look. Wool. Yeah, we've got a decent amount of wool, actually. So let's, um, let's assign one of our builders to come over here, though. Blacksmith, blacksmith, builder. So let's do Claude will become a weaver. Excellent, Claude, go for it. And how many can work here though? Two. So actually, I didn't even have two over here then. No, Claude will come over here. We had two. Claude is definitely on his way. Claude is a weaver. He's Making his way there definitely. I think I've got now three, three builders. We definitely need the, the ability to filter that. Claude is still bringing some stuff and will then do, do other things. Building completed the Lord Manor. Of course, we needed that. So now we're up to 2,000 gold that we can store. That's pretty good too. I'm happy with that. Now there's a little path that goes beyond here. Can't actually assign workers. And there's a pretty decent maintenance cost on this. Can't imagine what the church is going to require. Maintenance cost less, much less. The church is almost done. So just stone, stone, stone. Once we uh, get the stone, we can reassign some people to other uses. So now the question is, are we getting enough flour being produced? Now flour might be the bottleneck. So I'm pretty keen to be able to start to figure out what the bottlenecks are and so on. I think that's one of the key parts of a game like this. 
is to get your efficiencies up and running but i'm pretty sure we're kind of at the end of this episode so i don't know if we're going to finish this off very soon so what we'll do is we'll finish this off in the next episode and then we'll see where we go from there but i think that is probably around the content that is available at the moment but it is an awesome game i am absolutely in love with it guys if you've liked this episode please hit the like button and i will see you next time thank you bye bye